Welcome to the Rocket Pool Staking Protocol Explainer Series. This video is a high level overview of Rocket Pool and how to stake using the protocol. Here, we will give an overview of all aspects of Rocket Pool, a decentralized, trustless, and community owned staking protocol designed for Ethereum 2. No matter if you're brand new to Ethereum 2 staking, an experienced staker, or even a high level staking as a service provider, this series will provide valuable insights into how you can use Rocket Pool to stake in Ethereum 2. Rocket Pool is the base layer protocol for decentralized and trustless Ethereum 2 staking. All types of stakers are supported by the Rocket Pool protocol, and anyone can trustlessly stake on a network of decentralized node operators with full autonomy. The core premise behind a protocol is to ensure the network is not beholden to any one party. This is a principle directly linked to Ethereum, and a mindset used at every stage of the process as Rocket Pool was developed. Since the majority of players either lack the technical skills to run a node or the financial capacity to own 32 ETH, a protocol layer for Ethereum 2 which caters to them is important. Staking as a service providers, supporting institutional capital, hedge funds, family offices, and everything in between can help the world better access the benefits from staking ETH. So Rocket Pool was designed with these providers in mind. ETH holders can pay a provider or be paid to be an operator. With Rocket Pool, providers maximize their returns by being paid ETH and RPL to run a node. Individuals or teams can run their own infrastructure and use Rocket Pool to stake in batches of 16 ETH, allowing them to put their capital to work further and earn a larger share of returns. This means Bison Trails or Gemini could use Rocket Pool the same as a DeFi power user. Simply show up with 16 ETH and you're treated the same as any other node operator. Rocket Pool is designed to cater to two main user groups those that wish to participate in tokenized staking using our ETH and those that wish to stake ETH and run a node. When a user deposits ETH into Rocket Pool, they receive our ETH in return, which then begins accruing staking rewards based on performance of the decentralized network of node operators on Rocket Pool. Our ETH may also be traded or added to liquidity pools in the wider DeFi landscape. Depositing ETH and receiving our ETH can be done in a single transaction by a variety of different user groups, such as dApps, exchanges, wallets, or anyone looking to build on top of a Rocket Pool protocol. Staking this way requires no infrastructure and can be done with as little as 0.01 ETH. Once you have our ETH, you'll also be able to trade this back to Rocket Pool for ETH, plus rewards at any time, as long as liquidity in the deposit pool will cover the amount. No need to wait a few years for Phase 1.5 or 2 of the ETH2 rollout to have liquidity or get your staking rewards. Awesome! Rocket Pool allows anyone to earn a greater ROI staking inside the protocol versus outside of it. Node operators earn rewards on their 16 ETH deposits and a commission from the user's deposits. Node operators stake their own 16 ETH and 16 ETH on behalf of the protocol. The 16 ETH from the protocol comes from users depositing ETH and receiving our ETH. Herein lies a neat feature of Rocket Pool versus staking solo on the beacon chain. Splitting up your 32 ETH pools into 16 ETH pools paired with users' deposits earns a higher return than staking alone. Node operators can also stake 32 ETH, so they can start earning rewards immediately from their own deposit. The protocol will then buy out 16 ETH from their deposit and replace it with our ETH users' deposits when available. This allows operators who don't wish to wait on user deposits to start earning rewards on their ETH immediately. The commission rate that a node operator receives from users' deposits is variable and depends on the number of nodes available versus users' deposits. The more nodes available, the lower the commission rate. The less nodes available, the higher the commission rate. A higher commission rate will incentivize more nodes to be operated, driving the commission rate to a stable value over time. 
RocketPool is designed to reward node operators for providing valuable insurance in the case they are heavily penalized or slashed. When depositing ETH, node operators must also deposit a minimum amount of RPL to act as collateral in the case they incur any of these penalties. Should a penalty occur, the collateral is sold for ETH at auction and the proceeds from this sale are given back to the protocol to compensate for the missing ETH. When a node operator provides an amount of RPL as an insurance promise, they are also rewarded with RPL rewards respective to the amount of collateral they provide. The minimum collateral required is currently 10% of the ETH value and capped at a maximum of 150%. So, want to get a good feel for Rocket Pool right now? You can stake, get our ETH, and run a node. We have a live beta on ETH2 Paramount Testnet right now. Links to these are in the description below. If you have any questions or want to learn more, please join our Discord.